I'm Shingo Abe, a newbie who started working at a big IT company this year. I worked really hard to get this job, but I already feel like giving up. Ugh, my tasks just won't end by afternoon. I have many types of tasks to do. It's hard. We have quotas to clear in sales, but I'm also at the bottom. Hey, Abe, are you still in the office? Ugh, Chief Kazuma. Jeez, until when are you gonna do desk work? You're a salesman. Get it done right now and go sell out there. But, but, I need to finish making proposals for my clients. Huh? What? An excuse? You're on the edge. I'm warning you. Ugh, so sorry. It's okay. You can do it. Okay. He's competent, but misunderstands that I just don't take work seriously. He cheers me up like this, but honestly, I just can't keep up with him. Hmm. I gotta go. I'm counting on you. Hmm. And this is an additional task for you. Finish it when you're back. Hmm? Not again. The deadline for tasks from him is always soon. It takes me a long time to finish them, so I just can't work outside the office. He's made my quota even harder recently. I can't make it unless I get new clients. So I started doing walk-in sales. But what do I do? My company is big, so I can't really find a company that isn't our clients. There are only small companies that aren't our client in the area that I'm in charge of. Well, it can't be helped. I should go from company to company anyway. I started visiting many companies. Then? Well, I haven't been to this area yet. Huh? Ah! Is this... Wow! It's run down as usual. This is no good. I've heard of this company because there's a rumor about it at my company. That company must be about to go bankrupt. I agree. Who would walk into a company like that for sales? My co-workers often talk about this company. Nobody wants to visit there. However, I need to visit more companies than usual. So I gathered the courage to walk in. I have to do it. All right. Hello? Sorry for visiting all of a sudden. I'm Shingo Abe from Dokugumo Net. I'd like to speak with someone in charge of sales. Ah, are you a salesman? Come inside. I'm in the president's room on the second floor. Th thank you very much. Coming in. Was she the president? I'm glad that I get to talk to her directly. But... Ugh, it's messed up inside too. Come in. What kind of person is she? I'm worried. That's how I felt, but the moment I walked in, I got surprised. Coming in. I'm sorry for... Hmm? Hello, I'm Hina Sakurai, the president of Hominoba Packaging. What? The president was a beautiful female. However, her clothes were worn out. Seems like she doesn't pay attention to her appearance. This is... something's wrong. Hello? Oh, nothing, sorry. I introduced myself and did business. But, it's plain. I'm sorry. We can't spend much money on the systems. We can't make a lot of use of them. I see. Well, I understand that they don't have a lot of budgets. She turned my proposal down, but we had a chat after that. Seems like Sakurai-san is very frugal and doesn't try to make herself look good. This used to belong to my father. But there are times when she's kind of goofy. Oh, let me get it. Hmm? Hey! She doesn't even care. She's loose in both a good way and a bad way. Anyway, you're a newbie and hardworking. N no, I'm just... So your company is a packaging maker, isn't it? Yep. We have a small factory in the back. We make stuff there. Oh, I know. I need to go to the factory now. You want to come see it? Huh? I wouldn't say right now, but maybe we can work on something together in the future. Oh, okay. Sure. 
She said she'd let me see the factory, but actually, I didn't expect a lot. Seems like this company has financial difficulties. However, the moment I saw the factory, my mind changed. So, this is it. Huh? What? what the? This is awesome! I thought her company was all about ready-made goods, but all the packages that they make here are originals. Plus, they're all fashionable. Wow! That shop's paper bags are made here? I've seen that box over there! I never thought that they handled this many types of goods. I've done some jobs with package makers, but I've never seen a company that makes original stuff with outstanding designs. Hina-san, I have a question about the color of this design. Well, maybe we should get the gradation a bit thicker. There are both full-time and part-time workers in the factory. The number of them is low. She told me that they are all her family members or friends. She doesn't hire a lot of people. So she's frugal that way too. But after hearing the details about the company's financial circumstances, it turns out that its turnover is very good. Wh why is it? If it's going this well, you can do more like, you know, you can do renovations partially. Well, but... President Sakurai told me more about her company. Her father started this company, but he passed away because of an illness 10 years ago. And then she took over the company and has been running it with everything she's got. She had a great sense of design to begin with, so she designed stuff on her own and developed new shapes for packages. By the way, the reason her clothes are worn out is that she's totally cheap. This company wasn't doing well when her father was the president, so she lived in poverty ever since she was small. That's why she's still frugal. She doesn't spend much money on her appearance, but she's totally competent. I never thought a young, competent female like her was the president of this company. I'm a newbie, but I can tell. If we do renovations for the interior, this company will be even better. I'm sorry even though you came over. Well, this is how we are, so... Hmm... President Sakurai, could you listen to my proposal someday again? Whenever you're available. Huh? This company is great. It'll definitely develop more. All the products you make are awesome. I want to help you out. Abikun. Thank you. Then we should talk when we're available next time. Sure. Thank you. I started visiting her company often. She liked my proposal, but things didn't move forward instantly. I understand. Sorry. Thanks for listening to me when you're busy. I'll make a new proposal according to what I heard today and come back. Hmm. <laughs> you're really hardworking. Several days later. I gotta work harder. She can't make up her mind because she's not confident. I gotta come up with a proposal that is more reproducible. Hey, I hear he's been visiting that rundown company. He's nuts. Yeah. He should go to big companies. What is he thinking, spending a lot of time on that company? Mm. While the people around me looked down on me, I worked hard to come up with good proposals. Chief Kazuma started reprimanding me more often since he knew about me going to that company. Hey Abe, till when are you gonna keep going there? You can't expect anything from that company. That's not true. I'll definitely clear my quota. I didn't quit visiting President Sakurai because I wanted to help them out from the bottom of my heart. However, I didn't get to have a contract with them. Thanks for today too. Hmm, President Sakurai? Yeah? Uh, I'm sorry for making you spend time for me all the time. You must be busy. It's okay. I know you're hardworking and speaking with you is fun. Don't worry. Hmm. She's really a good person. Thank you. I'll come up with a good proposal next time for sure. Then I'm... Wow! Oh. Huh? Hmm? Oh, are you okay? Wow, I... I'm sorry. I didn't do it on purpose. I... <laughs> it's okay. You don't have to be cranky like that. You're so cute. Ugh, the attraction of a lady. I started taking work more seriously because of those days. 
and now I can handle the excessive tasks from Chief Kazuma. But he thought I wouldn't clear my quota, so he expanded the area I'm in charge of. Visit more companies starting today. Get new clients no matter what. You got that? Okay. I need to come up with proposals for President Sakurai at the same time. And several weeks later, I managed to clear my quota because I worked overtime every day. Hmm? Good. I never thought you'd make it. Thank you. I'm relieved. He'll acknowledge me. Then, your performance for this month will be mine. Sorry about that. Huh? Actually, my performance isn't very good this month. We should help each other. What? N no way. I was shocked. He made me cover his area and stole my achievement. Even someone like me protested. However, come on. They're doing this in all the departments. Don't be mad. Well, this is how society goes. Hmm? What the? And so, I got disappointed in my own company. But I had appointments with my clients, so I went out that day too. I saw President Sakurai at the end, but she figured out something was wrong with me. Abikun, what's wrong? You look depressed today. Something happened? Uh, she's intuitive. You always work hard for me. I'll listen to you. President Sakurai. I felt uncomfortable, but told her everything anyway. I shouldn't have told anyone my own company's negative parts, but I was at my limit. I see. Yeah. Sorry for telling you something like this all of a sudden. Abikun, what do you want to do at your company? Uh, well, making proposals for the companies that I want to help out. But you have to be healthy and feel like it to do that, right? Hmm? If you're having such a hard time, you don't have to bear with it. I run a company despite how I look. So listen to me. A hard worker like you will definitely be successful. President Sakurai. We can choose how to work nowadays. There are a lot of system engineers that are freelancers. If you don't want to work as a freelancer, you can change jobs. Well, it's more like I want you to work for me. Huh? <laughs> Sorry for telling you this all of a sudden. But I think someone like you shouldn't be in a situation like this. Of course, you should be the one to decide your future plans. I don't want to force you. I just want you to think about it. Hmm. I never thought she'd say something like that. When I was looking for a job, I only cared about how big and stable the company was. And I got my current job. But I learned that there are many things that you can't understand until you actually do it. And honestly, I realized I wanted to work for a company that needs me and rates me right. So I... All right. Several weeks later, thanks for everything. Hmm. So you're actually gonna quit. Whatever. I didn't expect a lot from you. I'll explain to my supervisor somehow. Then goodbye. And so I quit the company filled with greedy workers. And then I started working for Homenoba Packaging. President Sakurai, I'll work hard for you from now on. Thanks. I'm happy we're gonna work together. But, you don't have to be that polite. Now you're one of the workers. We should call each other by our first names. Huh? But... It's okay. This is how I deal with my workers. I'm counting on you, Shingo-kun. Uh, okay. Hmm... Hina-san. <laughs> Good. Well then, I'd like you to start with... Ah, Hina-san. There's something I want to tell you. Hmm? Could you leave this company's systems to me? Huh? I'm very thankful to Hina-san who gave me this job. I just spent as much time as I could figuring out what I could do for you. I'll get a good result for sure. Shingo-kun. I don't have much experience in sales, but I've been studying to be a systems engineer since I was in college. I learned more at my previous company, so please, I can do it. Okay, I'll leave it to you. Th thank you very much. My new life started that day. I talked with Hina-san, so she gave me the minimum facilities I needed. I worked very hard every day. I'll definitely make it. I went through this before. And several months later, everyone used a new system that I made. 
Wow, this is great! Abakun, you're a genius! What we've been doing manually up till now has been automated. I'm glad you guys liked it. You made this whole thing in such a short time. Awesome, Abakun, thank you! No, it's because you prepared the facilities for me. I'm really glad that everyone liked it. Yeah, I'm so happy too. Hmm? I never thought things would be so efficient and everyone would be so happy if I spent money on something I'm supposed to. Yeah, I want to increase this company's turnover more. I mean, it should. Would you consider expanding business? Yeah, totally. I understand what's important. I'll work hard for everyone. I'll rethink about the budget. Thank you. And so I made more and more new systems. Hinasan and I had a lot of meetings and the company developed. We started getting calls from new clients and often held negotiations to make room for more offers. Well, starting tomorrow, we're gonna continue negotiations with a lot of companies. Let's do our best. Yeah, but... Hinasan, can we take care of your appearance? Huh? But... We don't have to spend money on me. There are things we should prioritize. No, the first impression is important. I mean, it's gonna be troublesome if you go like that. Hmm? What do you mean? Uh, I mean... Tina-san, you're beautiful. You should think about how guys look at you. Hmm? Uh, okay. If you say so, Shingo-kun. I'm relieved. She accepted my opinion. I went shopping with her after work to make her take the least care of her appearance as the president. Then... How do I look? I'm kind of embarrassed. You're so beautiful! Huh? Ah, uh, mmm... Sorry, I... Uh... <laughs> I'm glad. I'm satisfied. Sh she's really beautiful. I and Hinasan kept going out for sales. Since our company became more famous, we got to negotiate with the owner of a major brand apparel shop. And then... This package is really good. Can we make a contract right away? R really Thank you very much! You can't blame us for getting surprised. This shop's owner is Hideto Kamiya, a son of Kamiya Industries. We were very happy that a person like him accepted our products right away. Hinasan, we did it! Yeah, it's because of you, Shingo-kun. <laughs> you guys are really getting along. So, do you run your company as a married couple? Uh, no, we aren't a couple or anything. Oh, okay. But I think you two look good together. Ugh. And several years later, Hominoba Packaging became a top-rated company. Our turnover kept increasing even after the contract with Kamiya-san. We bought new facilities and built more factories. Our work became more and more efficient because of the systems I made, so we can mass-produce our products now. But one day, that guy came to our company. Uh, hello? Kazuma-san, it's been a while. Seems like our company's in the area that he's in charge of. So the president told him to negotiate with us. Our company has developed this much. I understand. However, I must refuse. Huh? No matter what, we negotiate with anyone but your company. You know why, don't you? Ugh. Oh no. I heard that Kazuma-san got demoted. He kept calling us for sales insistently after that, so I reported him to his company and the president got really mad at him because he failed to make a contract with us and made a competent worker leave. I also heard that he couldn't stand his circumstances, so he quit the job and became homeless. On the other hand, I'm still working with Hinasan peacefully. Hinasan, what kind of thing do you want to try next? I'll make it come true. Well, I guess... Hmm? Our business is stable now, so I'd say I want to marry. Huh? So, would you be the one for me? What? Hey, what are you talking about? Come on, I've been approaching you lately. I'm serious. Oh. Hmm? My life changed a lot before. 
but seems like even happier days are waiting for me.